admits he's guilty. A judge sentenced him to 30 years for killing his wife Julie in January of 2014, then setting their Reedland home on fire. These are the charges he admitted to today. Murder, arson, tampering with evidence, cruelty to animals, and a new charge added just today, criminal solicitation. Local 6's Juliana Valencia was in the courtroom this afternoon. She joins us live from the McCracken County Courthouse. Juliana, do we know why Griffith entered today's guilty plea? The prosecution believes a big reason Griffith entered a guilty plea is because of the new charge of criminal solicitation. Again, that's where Griffith is accused of asking another inmate to shoot the lead detective on the case, Matt Carter, at his home. Now, once Griffith pled guilty to all his charges, sentencing him to 30 years, Judge Kaltzman asked if he had anything else left to say. There's no excuse for what I did, and I can't take it back. And she was my best friend, and I don't know what happened to me. But I did it, and there's nothing I can do about it. I'd die ten times over to bring her back. I loved her with all my heart, and I don't know what happened. Griffith's children were not in the courtroom, but the prosecutor on the case says the children wanted to make sure their dad admitted to killing their mom. Now tonight at 10, I'll have reaction from law enforcement on today's guilty plea. Live in Paducah, Juliana Valencia, WPSD, Local 6. Boy, really intense testimony there. Juliana, thank you.